Are the Lexus Sablone Chameleon Nike SBs a good hold or sell now? Will these go up or will these just go down? Find out. Hey man, say man, it's Armand Tubro in the cut on the mic. As you can see, and today we're gonna be discussing a hold or sell on the Alexis Sub. I'm not, hold on, I'm, I gotta reassure what these are called. They're like the Alexis Sublone SBs. Let me check real quick. Okay, yes, I was correct. They're called the Alexis Sublone Chameleon, like Chameleon, whatever you wanna say, SBs. They just came out, I'm gonna pop them on the screen right here. They're actually really nice. I actually kinda like these. They have like a scaly Nike swoosh and like kind of a scaly like chameleon look. Apparently these have like some cool features I'm gonna get into, but before we get in this video, drop a like, drop a sub, hit the notif notification bell. But let me take a sip of water real quick and let's get in this video. All right, bet. They just came out yesterday. Um, today is the 30th. They came out, I'm pretty sure yesterday on the 29th. I, yeah, they did. They came out yesterday because I literally got the got them. Probably gonna pop, my, pop up my got them I got yesterday. I did not expect to hit these. I just said, I was pretty much just like, they came out at 11 a.m. So whenever it was like 10 .05, I was like, dang, I missed that drop. But then I realized they did, they like came out with a pack of them. They came out with like, let me pop up this on StockX and see how much this pack's going for real quick. Okay, but I'm gonna pop up with this like pack, like special box. They came out with these at 10 a.m. yesterday. And then they came out with this, the normal chameleon SBs, like just the SBs. The pack, like it came in like a special box. It was pretty much a special box for those SBs that came out. And then like these uh, Converse's, I guess they're both a collab of like the skater uh, called like Alexis Sablone. I'm assuming this is a girl skater. Let me check if this is a girl skater or a guy skater or if this is even a skater in general okay yeah this is a girl skater apparently she like was in the olympics or something like that so apparently it's a skater it's a collab shoe but these are actually really nice so it is a girl shoe i could see um i like i was expecting more girl sizes i'm gonna go into market details so i was expecting the shoe to do better in like smaller sizes like girl sizes but they sold out pretty quick yesterday i just went in on two accounts like they, whatever um like i said they came out like 11 a.m so it was kind of an unusual drop for sneakers so i feel like some people just didn't even know and that's maybe why i hit because looking at stock numbers i'm probably not gonna pop up, pop up stock numbers on the screen because that's a little bit more private you know like it's yeah it's kind of like private info kind of but yesterday they literally only had apparently 367 size 13s drop let me see if i'm right on that okay apparently like hold on, let me see if i'm right on that because that's really low yeah apparently they only came out with th uh, 361 size 13s yesterday and i literally hit on one of them so a total of 8800 pairs roughly pretty much 8900 pairs that came out of these sbs on the sneakers app keep in mind they probably skate shops like your local skate shops um, i didn't make a how to cop video on these i should have did that but your main way to cop sbs is your skate shop near, near you because usually skate shops get good stock or like stuff like this but then like they won't put much stock on sneakers so yeah skate shops is the move if you're trying to hit on a pair of these apparently they were pretty easy to get in skate shops but then again i entered up like one i think i just like this one skate shops raffle for these and i didn't hit i entered up on a size 13 which is like pretty it's a pretty tough size to get in a sbs because it's looking at stock numbers right now size 13 is like one of the most limited sizes besides like size 14 size 15 there's literally just 34 size 15s probably because not many people wear a size 15 but then again sbs kind of runs kind of small so really like if you're like a size 14 you could wear a 15 but yeah so they there there's not many like there's like stock was really low on these so let me pop up market and let's get into that okay before i pop up market on this the alexis sablone sbs like the special box version of these that came with the converse is too i guess that's like the her skater like i guess she did a converse collab too it's kind of like interesting i don't know like is converse like owned by nike or something like that because they dropped a converse on the sneakers app so i could be tripping converse could be owned by nike i'm just not kind of completely sure that i'm sure they are because i don't think nike would release another brand under on their app but uh looking at market right now for the special box version it's crazy like size 10 and a half ask is 600 last sale was 449 so yeah i'm gonna probably pop a market on those mark is pretty insane on those but i just assume why because literally i looked at stock numbers for those there's literally like 34 pairs of the special box version they dropped on the stinger sack so your best bet was probably like a skate shop if they got special i don't think any skate shops really got special box version so that was like super limited but yeah who would really want to pay up for like a special box version of these like you're only getting one good shoe which is the sbs and the converses are kind of whack not gonna lie no offense to anyone that likes the converses but the sbs are like the main prize that's why like majority of people that were going for the special box just want the sb so yeah let's get into the sb market on this like the sb itself that which dropped at 11 a.m which was separate from the special box version they literally dropped like none of the special box version but they ended up dropping about 8k pairs pretty much 9k pretty much like roughly 8900 pairs so 9k pairs roughly of these sbs so that's pretty limited you know that is pretty limited just like any sb 
they usually do good over time especially if it's a decent colorway which these are pretty decent i actually like them they have like some cool variations like they have like some cool uh details like apparently i don't know how like true this is but i guess when you skate them they i might pop up on the screen if i could find a picture that like, they turn purple and then apparently like every like color like looks every pair like looks different like the green but i could be wrong on that but because you know like chameleons like you know they blend into things but yeah it's actually a really cool player uh, pair but i could just be saying that because i like green but yeah pretty easy to wear pretty nice right now looking at market uh size 13 the pair that i hit is going for around a 180 and then like bigger sizes is pretty much going from 170 to 180 size 14 15 is actually going for a lot of money right now size 15 ask is 250 but last sale was like 190 so roughly this pair is kind of sitting at 180 and bigger sizes and smaller sizes around 150 depends the size though uh, size four and a half which is actually pretty surprising is ask is 180 so that's pretty surprising but it's like more of a girl size so i can see why but yeah this pair markets is really low on these right now because well it's not that low but it's pretty low like 180 for a size 13 sb that never lasts long like it, a size 13 shouldn't be the same price as a size 11 honestly size 13 is always more limited like let me look at stock numbers right now yeah there was literally like almost double the amount of pairs that dropped in a size 11 than size 13 yesterday on sneakers so that usually never lasts long usually a pair like this will tend to age well especially like sbs has always been ten, uh, like aging well just look at any sb but yeah this any sb they usually do good over time especially if it's a decent colorway just look at any sb that's came out within like the last year for example tight booth sbs i was not the best looking like sb but right now bigger sizes of tight booth sbs they're going for like let me check right now yeah right now a size 13 the tight booth sbs i remember these came out like not long ago like literally probably a year ago and a size 13 is going for 300 so the reason why i'm referring to size 13 is because i hit on a size 13 yesterday i got that got them getting a got them on nike on sbs on the sneakers app usually even like sometimes even like brick sbs like even like the race of liao's let me compare these to the race race of liao since like race of liao i bet was a girl skater too because it's kind of more of a girly shoe so you can kind of that's more of like a better comparison for like how the shoe is going to do let me see what the races are going for right now okay right now a size 13 the races are going for 200 and there's only 15 left on uh stock x it says so this pair is getting kind of limited so to see uh size 13 only going for 200 dollars in these that's kind of like that's low i mean i don't know so i see these probably i don't know i feel like selling your pair right now would be kind of you know you can if you want to get that small profit but yeah market will hold up on these like i feel like probably near christmas they probably would be around 200 dollars in bigger sizes but yeah like i was saying getting a god on uh, sb on the sneakers app is even if it's like a kind of like a brick sb like not even a brick sb but a, like an sb that's going for like 40 dollars, 50 dollars of retail people are always thirsty for sbs everyone's going for them so it's really all right to kind of sum up this video i'm tuning back into this video my bad my camera cut out but yeah pretty much this is a pretty good hold sb this is a pretty nice sb with good details and it's a collab so just to, you know wrap up this video honestly i think it's a good hold but if you want to sell it make your little 40 50 bucks right now or if you can make more i'd go ahead and you know i mean i wouldn't say go ahead and do that honestly if you got a bigger size or even like a nine plus or really even smaller size might be doing pretty decent in the shoe like i said a four and a half right now is going for some money uh i didn't check market that was on saturday today is sunday so yeah actually that was friday so market might have changed but i don't know but yeah pretty much i would say this shoe is a pretty good hold all sbs are doing pretty good over time to be honest but yeah so yeah that's just kind of you know wrap up this video i'd say hold them if you have a bigger size especially like a good size like a 13 14 even a 15 you know they just don't make many like big size sbs so yeah but like i said i'm very um very grateful to hit on my, uh, my size size 13 i would tow this pair it's actually a really nice pair i'm gonna be getting a couple pairs in hand here soon within the next couple days with my pair from sneakers and i copped a couple pairs off some people so yeah stay tuned for that um, i'll be doing an unboxing of this pair and a little, uh, of this pair and a little review i would do it on fee review but uh, i'm not really too crazy about this pair but i'll see how i like them in person they have some good details like i said so yeah i do see this pair doing pretty decent over time honestly i could easily see a size 13 in the future going for 250 dollars but it might take some time so if you don't have the you know the capital to hold on to this pair i'd say sell them make your profit put it towards a better release you know we got some heaters coming in september so stay tuned for i'm gonna make a september video uh, talking about all upcoming heaters stay tuned for that video it's a little hint travis's are coming so yeah uh drop a like drop a sub hit the notification bell all that good stuff so i not miss no fire videos and peace